football and fashion making a fantastic fusion right there. But here's a very sad reality. It is, un it is most unfortunate and sad that often it's children who suffer in socially difficult situations, as we can see at the many traffic lights that we drive past every single day. Now, the problem with giving street children money is that it feels a vicious cycle that keeps them there. So how about rather giving to an initiative that is addressing the problem straight on, like Street Smart? In fact, take a look at this. This is what they're all about. Enjoying a first-class meal at a restaurant like this, yes, can be quite a self-indulgent and personal experience. But with a little bit of inspiration, it can also be a driver for social change. And when part of a collective, bring about a massive impact in the lives of people who desperately need it. Street Smart was established under the patronage of Archbishop Desmond Tutu. The funds raised go to organizations that run programs for the normalization of vulnerable children's lives. What was... The, the prompt to get you involved to step up and answer the call to action. Well, it's actually such a great initiative because uh, five rand isn't a lot of money and a lot of five rands make a huge difference in your community. I have to ask though, how do customers respond? Do you not feel that you're kind of imposing on them or do they not react negatively? Customers' response has been great. Uh, we've got a lot of tables that actually add on more money onto, onto the Street Smart account. You donate five rand while having a great meal and I think it's just the right thing to, to, to donate to the less fortunate while having such a great meal. The success of the Socially Aware project is a combination of restaurant participation and the generosity and contributions of informed patrons. Take me back a few steps. How did this all originate? Started 10 years ago when Margie Bix and myself went to a World Travel Market in London and we saw a cart not dissimilar to this one um, where they collected uh, one pound uh, for the homeless. It was a seasonal campaign and we thought, let's take it to South Africa, let's make it an annual campaign running throughout the year and dedicated to street children and those at risk. Talk me through how the process actually works. They collect money from their diners, five rand at a time per table, not per person. Um, they add it onto, their, uh, onto the bill. Um, there's a point or a button on the point of sale system. And at the end of the month, uh, they send uh, the money right through to Street Smart and we then pass it on to uh, pre selected charities within the area of operation of the restaurant. Now, last year alone, over a million rand, and I'm going to say it again, a million rand raised in just a year. Well, how does that, that money get used? You must be able to make a huge impact. It goes to the uh, charities that operate in the area of the restaurant where the money is being collected. And it's important to say that all these 1,040,000 were from five rand at a time. So each region gets that money that's collected in the region and I think that's one of the important uh, points that we uh, want to drive home to the diners but also to the people who run the restaurants there. All the operational costs of Street Smart are sponsored, meaning every cent of the funds raised through the restaurants go towards making a real difference. See Graham, that's what it's all about. This is what makes it worthwhile. All the work that we do with Street Smart, when you see where the money then actually hits the ground, where Work is being done with those kids who otherwise would look at um, another reality. They're laughing, they're smiling, they're loving it here. I think when you drive through the community on your way here, it really does hit home how important having a facility like this is in this community. And that is where the thing comes together, they do aftercare, they are here and not on the streets. When I'm a bit down, that's what gives me a kick. As Nelson Mandela said, education is the most powerful weapon which you can use to change the world. And giving these children a platform to grow is vital in the learning process. Give me a bit of background. Very interesting name to your project, to the organization. Where did you guys first begin? Um, how did it all come about? Talk me through what you guys do. I think we started way back in 2004, where we rendered services in the uh, CBD of Cape Town. Uh, where we realized there was a lot of uh, children, uh, you know, begging on the street and basically making a living for themselves. We realized, but maybe it is not such a productive service to render on the street itself. We rather take the services where these children originally come from and, and render the service in those particular communities, those communities that, you know, struggle with po poverty, those communities you know, that perhaps don't have the necessary uh, know-how, how to work you know, with their children and things like that. How has the community reacted to that? Now we create an opportunity via Street Smart to help them with their schoolwork in order for them you know, to progress you know, to the next level. I find it useful that Mr. Thomas helped me to do my schoolwork. My favourite part is I live playing with my friends in the park. If we do our work done, then we go to eat. And when 
we after after eat we get a fruit and then we go home the beauty of this project is its simplicity and with nearly a hundred restaurants involved nationwide and counting the potential for making a lasting change is incredible to the multi-service centre from Cape Town, to Street Smart, to the restaurants that are connecting, and most importantly to you, the diners that are adding that little bit extra, we've got one thing to say to you. Thank you very much! Well done!